Fanny stopped in just a few minutes before we start. She said she'll be a little late, but she'll be back. Okie dokie, artichoke. Evie Eve. What up? What's up, everybody? We were going to make um, some chicken noodle soup tonight, but I, I barely wanted to come on. So I'm on here. No soup. But I'm here. I just wasn't. See, y'all, I told him about the non-delivery shit. I wasn't feeling it today, y'all. You lucky you got me on camera. 
Huh? Sound the alarm. It's not the right one. I just had it. I don't want to scoop it, but I also don't want to pour it. You know what I mean, motherfucker? Shit, actually, let me switch over to Kel's YouTube real quick. So instead, I'm making the garlic bread portion of what I was going to do both. I mean, meal and garlic bread or whatever, but he bailed on me, so we're just making the garlic bread. And I'll show you how to make the Hey, guess, what's up? Got to first get all your dry ingredients together. Now, I left you a thing to follow along in the description. A list of what you would need. Anyway, this is only a cup. I mean, top it all. Because this shit takes a lot of flour, but... So He's like making it. homemade chicken alfredo and asparagus. It sounds good. It was? Eve. Ooh. Thank you. I don't like you. asparagus, but I'm down with the homemade chicken. Yeah, I don't know. My anxiety's up. I just, I'm tired. Long week. But I don't want to let Kells down. I don't want to let you guys down. This one's fine. This one's fine. Always happens when you have Can you grab me the babies too? I just need like two of them. Up there. And why am I not scooping the flour out? Put bay leaves in your flour to keep them fresh. That's what that was about. Bay leaves go in your flour to keep the bugs like ants and stuff like that that find their way in your kitchen. Appreciate you, little sis. Good to see you too. Three. Anyway, I'm not scooping it because it compacts the flour and you end up with way more than the recipe calls for. You scoop it and I'm scooping poop. You got flour all over my bait. I agree with you, Al. There's not much pasta I don't like. Yeah. There's really not much pasta. <coughs> That's I, not true because the no second key. it's in a different color or a shape, he like, has a fit. I don't don't like, even listen to the cat. I don't fine. like Noki or Noki. The silent G. Noki. 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 Something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's one ah, I don't fuck. Like. That was four, right? Yeah. Four. Um. Jen, I love asparagus too. Kel makes it for me on Thanksgiving. Thursday's chair. If I make it, it's for him. It's not. What's up, Thursday? <laughs> What's up? I don't like Thursday that. Thursday on Thursday. Thursday. <laughs> yeah. Fun fact, Thursday stands for Thor's Day. Thor, like the Marvel guy. The Marvel I mean, it's guy. really for the Norse god. I was going to say. Yeah. The Marvel guy. Yo, look, Kels is using a spoon because she knows if she would have did this, y'all would have started ju being judgmental. <laughs> No, use you the scraper. This, use the this, scraper for that. Get this flour cleaned up. Yeah. I'll show you. I love that goes. scraper, guys. I was more excited about that scraper in my sister than fucking anything. This is how you get it up, guys. <laughs> and, and, want, this is my new bowl. Who am I laying one out for here? Thanks, who, who's, 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 taking, who's taking a line here? There you go. threw it right off the title. One in each mom. Those were the days. Who they ever. Man, I miss those days. I mean, but I don't miss it because it was crazy. I was fucking fist fighting people all the time. It's my shit. new whisk. Yeah, I love my new whisk. I don't know why, but I do. Uh, Eve, yes, homemade garlic bread. It's a kind of garlic bread. Kells um found a recipe on and wanted to try. The only difference is they use full cloves of garlic, and we're going to use mint. Mm -hmm. That's the only difference. It and all they really did was cut, like, you know how you have the whole clove? They just cut, like, they a slice down. No. They put the whole clove like that in the oven, roasted it, and then squeezed it, it out and mixed it, it in there. It was like a paste instead, yeah. yeah. 
And I'm using my new mix and wool, see, because thanks, mother in law. Move those for right now. Okay, so you want five cups of sugar, and these need to be your dry and your wet need to be in separate bowls until you mix them because. I mean, so. Pretty much. And this dough. You want to hold it over the screen right now? Well, no, I need it here. This dough. It, I got to redo it a little because, I mean, when I put the things up, because there is a difference between the yeast that you use. If you use this, what I have is instant yeast. Rapid yeast. And yes, Fleischmann's is the Fleischmann. best. Fleischmann. Yep. The best one to use. No, we're not sponsored, but. But we wouldn't mind one. We'll take a lifetime supply of yeast. For real, because. What I have is rapid rise, but I did have the other kind when I made the dough. You gotta get our manager Jen on. Jen's know. gotta start reaching out to sponsors. Um, usually I would have to put this in a bowl with like. Eve, we're not making nothing it? with it because I'm a slacker. Tablespoon? No, it's like two cups of warm water and then like a sprinkle of sugar, or like a quarter teaspoon of sugars because the sugar activates the yeast and then you're supposed to let it sit for like 10 minutes and you know it's done because it, it looks like like a foamy bubble bath on top when it's blooms and everything then you dump it in but this is ready to go and you just oh, dump it in mm -hmm. there's no need to let it Eve, we were going to make some homemade chicken noodle yeah. soup but um we might have had cheese steaks and french fries yeah we did I just, I, I'm not. I it. put them fries right in it. Uh, I figured I could come live and still do my color analyst stuff, but the chicken noodle soup would have really involved me doing the chicken soup. And I just, I feel like that. It wouldn't have really, but I'll let them get rid of that. I will do an upload with the chicken stock and show you guys how I do mine. See, I see a couple new folks popping in. Okay, Let's so we need a packet. It says two tablespoons of yeast. It's basically this whole packet. Don't go through measuring it because you'll drive yourself nuts. Just dump the damn Five, So in. far, guys, dry measurements. Five cups of flour, one pack of the Fleischmann's Rapid Rise. We're going to say what's up to D.O. True, True L.E.S. Make sure you guys subscribe. Ooh. Aussie Amy, great person. Koala Bear, emoji. <laughs> uh, make sure you guys subscribe to Amy we as well. We speak your emojis because we can't give them to you now. Uh, any content creators, as always, feel free to drop me a link. Um, if you don't have one, reach out to us a mod, and they'll def they'll kindly do it for you. We do have the best mods around. Mm -hmm. And if you're new, you'll be a mod in like three or four weeks. So hang in there, kid. Okay, wait. So I don't need this now. I don't need the sugar because the sugar was to activate the yeast and the warm water. So I do need a pinch of syrup. Mm -hmm. Olive oil. Sea salt. You want to use that or you want to use this? I could get a pinch of this. <laughs> it's all fit in there. Can you give me the things for the olive oil? I think I don't. I think I got to reset the check because it's telling me two, but there's like seven people talking. Yeah, 14. Got to go out and go back down. Yeah. yeah. I come back in, it says 14. So, I feel fucking bloated, but can I be honest with y'all? I feel bloated. He's about to get I think his I'm on my hurry. He's about to get his word the bait. Am I on my hurry? Two non crinkly ones. Non crinkly ish. Trucito. Hey, Dawn. Okay, so. Swinging by to show support. Love and thumbs up. Of course, I'm cooking dinner. Wheel's about to start. We're going to catch up later. Yes. What's I, about to start? She's cooking and wheel. Wheel fortune. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I remember when we used to watch it. Yeah. yeah. You used to watch Jeopardy and Wheel. Okay, six o'clock. Channel six was on from six, like one. My house said she was on from fucking noon. 
She oh, watched yeah, all the soap operas. Oh, well, Grandpa wasn't watching all that. My he mom watched. My story. mom watched the news, all the soap operas, Oprah, the news, <laughs> the news, right in the Jeopardy. Fun fact: I think my dad still watches General Hospital. I was born during that show. Incidentally, you're still at the same party. Amy like said, the same Amy said "Don't talk to me about bloated." <laughs> Mm -hmm. I don't know. I just, I don't know. We had a good dinner, though, so maybe it's just that. My You're stomach's cold. weird. It has been ever since. There's this weird lump in it from where it got <laughs> stitched back up. Wow. <laughs> I can see your whole ass right through that pit, right? Can you? Yeah. Black thumb. Yeah, I can. <laughs> this ain't the only thing. I'm glad you're telling everybody to color my drawers. This ain't right the only thing, right? It is now. I'll kick your card. Pick my cart. We'll show that cart whose business. You're lucky. Can't figure it out. I think it's like screwed on there. Like up here though. Because it moves. Mama T. I don't know why it makes that noise. It's supposed to lift. No, it's not. It looks like it. Try to pull it then. Oh, no. This is loose. That's why. Oh. But it's fucking Star Wars. I have to screw it. Okay. Oh, uh, boy, you need a quarter cup. So far, guys, five cups of dry flour, one package of the Fleischmann's ye instant yeast, a pinch of salt, and a quarter cup of, of oil. I might need some more stuff. Then you're supposed to, you combine it all, then you begin to knead it with a mixer or by hand. Usually a stand mixer works best with the paddle contraption drawn part. Yeah, that. And it'll, or the dough hook. The dough hook. Well, we ain't got either of them, so get the mixing. <laughs> if you'd like to see Kells get that stand mixer, the <laughs> P.O. box. My fucking front door. 50505. Do not send it to 50505. I don't even know where that is. Nobody knows. <laughs> the people who live there do. Oh, they fit in the fine day. Monica, salute. Beautiful Christmas card you sent. Yes, thanks. What are you doing? Come here. Come here. What are you doing? Touching it, you bets. You bets. No, you just, you just scar. It's supposed to be like really sticky. I might even need it to warm. Not just for it. You know this says when you that mix. It looks awful dry. I think you might. Need I guess it does. I think you might. Need to it's like ninety-eight percent flour. Yeah, I'm and two percent water. I'm agreeing with you. Where's the um? Hi, Mister Moon. <laughs> This is only a cup and a half. But you're supposed to slowly add in the oil. You dump the whole damn thing. Yeah. I know what I'm doing. I don't need your commentary. How many commentary. Times you made dough before? Plenty. I never knew you. As I said, I don't need your commentary. I didn't really? You didn't know I cooked for the first two years of a relationship, so. Make me a pizza. Proof your pizza. I've already made you pizza. We've done it together on this show. Yeah, I hope everybody who's dealing with the uh, C is uh, the C, the cocoa is feeling better. The cocoa, why, why? That shit's hitting everybody. Yeah. Salute to the brother, uh, JB. Spoke to him yesterday. Anyone who knows JB, day one. We talked on the phone for a little bit. I thought that was today. No, it was yesterday. Today's a long day, that's why. Need some more. Not too bad. Slowly though, yeah, just okay. saturate it. It's the same thing as we can't do what Katie did. It's the same thing as concrete. Yeah, more. Little, yeah, a little more. So. You gotta keep adding it. I got gotcha. you. Just keep mixing. Mhm. Kind of smells like baby formula. Because of the yeast. Use both hands. I'm gonna hold the bowl so Kelly can Kelly can use both hands, guys. 
I ain't said Kelly in a long time. That felt really weird. Good. Kelly. I hope it was a stabbed in a heart. Ooh, I like <laughs> them sounds. Okay. Kind of how it sounded. What do you want me to hit the bomb? <laughs> the For a little bit more. Not a lot, a little. You thought it was going to be more than that fourth. That's why you thought you were yellow. No, I mean, I wanted it in a certain spot. ATG barn in a motherfucking house. What's up, Jack? My brother, my brother. It's going to be really sticky at first, guys. I got to get a little more work. It's supposed to be, though. I think we need more work. Yeah. But not until. That's to make it less sticky. Don't pour all that in. I, obviously. I just poured the last one little by little, but this one I'm going to pour the entire thing. Gotcha. I trust you around for me. Babe, you know what? Better Go get, ahead. You better get mixing then before it gets too hot. What are you doing, Stop boy? Stop playing with the freaking water. Yeah, this kitchen. Come on. Come gentle me from. Got Peter after me again. Again. Let me cradle him like a little baby. Oh, I got you. I'll get you for him. No better. No kitchen. What is this? The fucking Flintstones, bro? I wasn't even back in the kitchen yet. He was coming. He like definitely doesn't. When it comes to the kitchen, he, he won't listen to that. I rub my hands together to get it off. Just trying to catch up with the chat. Nice to help. You want me to get in there for a minute or something? No. You gotta need it. I know what I gotta do. You gotta Thanks. body be dead, bitch. Body be good. I'm pretty sure. Oh, I'm gonna some snacks, feathers. He's fat, Jamie. Yeah, we got the camera. Oh, I'm answer. Go get it. What do you got? Oh, yeah, he heard it. <laughs> so he heard that bag. He almost just fell over his back seat. That cat will bulldoze over anything for them for getting treats. Now he likes finding it up where we have them and freaking pawing at it. He's cool. He's chilling like them. Matt Dillon on penicillin. Okay, now pour some of that on. What, where? No, the oil. The Earl? Mm -hmm. Much of I think so. It's getting there, guys. It's getting there. Um, Not really that bad. I think I'll bring you guys in for a close up. I'm going to have to need it on the table. Some flour. I'll bring you guys up for a close up view here. I'm trying to get it. No, you don't have to. I have it angled. I'm going to have to move it to this anyway. You know? Oh, you still have to flower that to... and everything. Keep that in the bowl for now. I'm trying to give everybody a good view. So we might need a few more drops of water. Mm, a little bit of oil. Now, normally when you let your dough rest so it can rise, you would oil the bowl, put this in it, and swirl it around so the oil goes all over it, then cover it with a towel. Or Boston Bama. Syrian wrap. <clears throat> but i don't have to do that because this recipe well you can i can set this aside la 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 Jan, pam said she not. would be late earlier in the chat i haven't really seen linda much at all now that you mention it mm -mm. and eve i've uh, talked to her but i haven't seen her atg barn with the share we appreciate you brother thank you bro oh uh, yes uh, mama t said oh my god you're using my new favorite bowl <laughs> I love this bowl. It's the one my dude, my mom got her. Mm -hmm. Tiny, tiny. I didn't you even do it. No, grabbing it by hand because it's like the consistency that I want. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Mm -hmm. As I go around, yeah. The water is what makes it more sticky. No more water. Yeah, I thought so, Mama T. Linda's taking a break from. Me. I was going to say, I haven't no, really seen really her. Blame her there. 
Let now, me. to make your dough less sticky, guys, before – sorry to cut you off, babe. No, you're fine. Um, add oil into onto your dough and just keep kneading it until it's less sticky. Yeah, I hope you guys, the angle's working better for you guys. I'm going to try to move the camera around a little bit. I know this is a pretty good angle right now. Once she pulls it on a table, I'll just pull us back an um, inch or two. Come on. Thank you. I'm going to clear all this off. So. I'm going to back you up just, a, just to get the whole table in the frame. Need that. All right, so it's just the table that's in frame. Okay. It kind of ends at the bowl. So why don't you move the bowl? We got to dry that up. Some of the water drip. Okay. Yeah, we got to dry it up or it becomes fucking slurch. Never mind. All right, guys. So you can put your hands in oil. Anytime before you deal with dough, you want to have a very good uh, powder layer. So that's your best bet. Drop it in one spot and then space it and spread it out. Give it a little across mm -hmm. the top. Let me make sure we're in an angle. Good, please. If you could just work a little forward from where you're at. Mm -hmm. Working towards the back, try to work closer to the front. And you should be pretty good. Like that, you mean? If you could come closer to the front of the table. Like work here. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> It might look like a pain in the ass, but guys, trust me when I tell you, kneading dough is very therapeutic. Uh, it's fresh. Trust me when I nothing, tell you. Nothing just, beats fresh either, though. Grab it, pull it, punch you, it. You could buy all the breads in the world. Damn it. Don't you need your rolling pin? I will. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just taking some and putting it on the roll thing, guys. Just make it less sticky when that time comes. Hold the table down for you. The key when you're rolling your dough out anyway, and you're trying to get it to the desired thickness. Well, we're going to be making a... Turning. You got to loaf this kind of, though, right? You got to cut it. Smear it with the stuff and then put no, it in the loaf pan, but like stacked. That's what I'm saying. You gotta, it. It's bread. It's got to be like loafed. Mm -hmm. uh, this isn't a bread. This is a pizza. Yeah, because you got to smear the stuff and then cut it with it and then stack it in there. Or you can pull globs of it and stuff it in there that way. And you oh, know, it's just like rip breakaway it bread. Mm -hmm. The one that I showed you was. They got it. They stretched it all out as far as they could, and then they um, they put this. They smeared the shit on there, and then they um, cut it with a pizza roller, and then they stacked it into yeah, the, yeah. the bread pan. Okay. Victoria, I'm just trying to get this stretched as appreciate you, Victoria, as far as I can. Hello, back it up some. I want you to freaking fall off the table. See, it stretches back, though. It snaps back. Appreciate everybody tuning in with us on this cold and dreary Thursday. Actually, it was nicer today than it's been. It wasn't too bad when I walked in last night, either. Like, the weather wasn't yeah. bad at all. And not compared, for being at nighttime. Compared to the day, though. I don't, well, so yeah, it wasn't too bad. I need butter to get out. Where is it? The what? I meant scarlet. It's on top of the salt, the big salt in the bottom. Mm-hmm. And I need the herbs. Victoria, it's going to be a um, 
A garlic bread. Depending on how low I get to. I mean, but... Damn, bro. Shut My bad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I need butter or so. Yeah. I need the butter. Um, Kitty Cat suggested um chicken and dumpling, uh, chicken dumpling sometime because of the dinner. I guess because of the dough. Oh, it's a good idea. Mm -hmm. I have a recipe for peach dumpling, so maybe I could just substitute the peach for fit for chicken. Are there any Star Wars fans here? Is anybody watching Book of Boba Fett? We watch it. It's pretty good. I like it. Tonight we're going to watch um, Peacemaker with John Cena. John Chenna. John Chenna. If he's a dick like the movie, I'm going to be mad. It's the same character. Of I don't course. care. Like I said. I mean, obviously you're going to be able to get it more depth. What's it going for? To mix it. I'm gonna mix it together before I go oh. so that way it's evenly distributed. Okay. That should be good. I guess. Mm -hmm. All right. All right, Kel's just trying to soften the butter up, mash it, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I'm cleaning it. We got parsley, oregano. Ooh. What else? That shit is bumping. And basil. All the good greens, all the stuff that looks like Reggie. Mm -hmm. yeah, that garlic is strong. Mm -hmm. This is spicy garlic. garlic. Like spice world, I mean. Garlic. That should be good, right? Ah, should we? You know, adobo. Remember, guys, oregano is the strongest of these three. Basil is the second. Parsley isn't really that strong. I also have rosemary, but that is strong and it's very, uh, according to, it's an acquired taste. Rosemary. And pond. You need the green stuff, Victoria. Duh. You need the greens. You didn't put no salt or purple. And then we get um, our stuff from up here, anthracite provision, sea salt. I also have pink Himalayan, but I like he thing. can't get his fingers in that bottle. No, I, just like, I like the sea salt. Actually, they say the best salt is sea salt because it's more pure. Yeah, it's not going through as much bullshit. Okay. All right, guys, so Kels is pretty much done mashing that up right there. Where's your um, to make it spreadable? Where's your loaf pain? Oh, this one, right? Mm-hmm. You're gonna need that butter. Mm -hmm. I use the spray butter. Yeah. yeah. I'm just gonna put it all over it. Spread it across the middle. We can hold the ends over the top. <laughs> you fold the ends in. I'm telling you what, that is a good looking mix right there with the minced garlic, minced garlic, butter, parsley, oregano, and basil. Guys. And trust me, guys, we've tried it with like the powdered garlic that you would use. Not, in dinner, it's not strong it's, enough. Yeah, it's not. Not even a little. We tried bit. doing like a white pasta that we do last night with garlic powder, and you couldn't tell her it tastes like just plain noodles. Yeah, like, I couldn't even tell her. It was you need to get yourself that. the minced or the whole. Guys, your oven should be preheating to three seventy five. Damn it! Just trying to scrape the last little bit shot on the floor. Great. And just have fun with it, guys. I mean, we don't... Most, most times, we're practicing shit like when we're on here with you. We don't really do a lot. 
We don't really do a lot beforehand. I usually tell you guys, but I figure by now it should go without saying. Yeah. So we pretty much just wing it with you guys and I try it for see the first time because I see it and I'm not gonna do it fifteen times. I'm just gonna do it once. You guys wanna see it? Yeah, right. Uh true, not the red oh that shit looks like Reggie. Okay. Victoria, she said, yes, I am that annoying person that sits there and picks out the green stuff for my food. They're spices. Girl, you'd never be eaten. They're spices. How are you enjoying anything if you're picking it? All right, so here's our loaf pan, guys. I'm thinking we just put it in like this. What, you want me to just cut it, and then we can stack it in there? Or we can, I'm saying you can probably stuff do it in there loaf. so we can go out. Like, you can probably do the whole loaf pan. It's going to drape over it. You, put, you fold them. Oh. Grab that in. I'll show you what I mean. If it don't work, it don't work. We gotta cut them down. Over here. Lay it right in. Make sure you get a lot in there. And then you fold these up. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Kind of the same thing without cutting them. Just wedging it in there any way you can, really. Well, not really. You want to try to get it some kind of structure. It's not going to do that. I don't fucking know. You want to cut into pieces. Yeah, that's what I said. Then let's so do that. I don't know why you're over here. I was trying something. Wing it, like we just said. Give me the pizza roll. That seems to go out. Look, quick. no harm, no fail. Mm hmm. I don't know when that man's going to start listening to me. Oh, you were good. How many times I got to prove to be right? When FM, saludo, saludo. Out, FM, make sure you guys check out New York Creep Spotlight. Great page, doing great things for the communities. So, yeah, I don't understand. I don't follow. You know, just show me. Like, what you mean, like, overlapping and shit? That's going to be video, one piece of bread? Yeah, in the video, they did like this, and then they would cut, like, another piece, and it goes on top. And they stack it like this, or this, in the pan. All the way up the pan, you know, and then they put it in the oven. Why are you overlapping them? Because that's how they did it. I'm asking, yeah, I'm asking Into why. the bread pan. I'm asking why. And then. I don't know why. Because it's all got to cook together, baby. Yeah, I don't know why you can't just do one. Is what, I was Go ahead. what do you mean why you can't do one? Because you put two pieces together. Why not just put one in there? Why does it have to be, have one over it? I how are you going to just cook one? You got to cook them all together. The point is, right. is to cook it like a loaf in the oven. I'm saying that. Not together. That's what I meant. There's two there. Okay, my point is, how are you going to separate it, babe? It, it's all cooking it together. Was separated. You put them together. In the pan, you can't cook them separate. Obviously. I'm saying, I don't, they're stacking over each other. I feel like you're taking something away from it by doing that. That's why I'm asking. No, this is how they did it. This is how why when Man, how the fuck I know they ain't idiots. I mean, uh, we they gotta might be. be. That don't mean we gotta be, because they were. If you tip you tip it up, it'll sit on a slant so you can stack it easier. That's why I stacked them on top of each other and then fit it into the pan. Just keep cutting, homes. But Mr. can't listen to anything. I am. Got these I'm doing it exactly how you wanted it. No, you're not, but okay. No, you know, I'm stacking the pieces. That's not what I meant by stacking. It's not done yet either. Okay. You did the first two. Yes, and I told you how it gets stacked in there. Like this. All the way up the damn pan. Well, like, yeah, what kind of like weird, a ladder. They don't stand up. How am I supposed to do that? You stand the pan, babe. No. You put it in the bottom as you're stacking it. Therefore, gotcha. it stays. I understand now. Oh my god! I didn't understand you were using the thing to hold that freaking shit up. Well, how else are we going to do it? The we way we were just doing cooking. it, they were staggered nicely. Well, then stagger it how you want. I'm just trying to cut them, and then I got to cut that wonky, weird piece there. Oh, Welcome man. to arguing in the kitchen with Murph and Cows. Oh man. Just know this is how we this is how every day goes with every subject we argue. 
Yep. The other day, Audie said to Cows, you're lucky you got Murph. I said, girl, we just got done arguing. There wasn't no lucky in that argument. I'm an asshole. <laughs> and he was being quite the asshole. Here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Bringing up unnecessary shit. Shut up. Mm -hmm. Oh, now it's shut Am up. Am I doing this? You don't want to hear nothing. Is that it? Mm-hmm. Like I said, I didn't watch your stupid like videos, so I don't. Yes, know. you did. No, I didn't. I seen you watch. I closed you liar. my eyes. You liar! I closed my eyes the whole time. The whole time. What is even the point? I don't get it. My eyes were closed. Then why would you watch a video? Uh, so you would. Think why would I you turn watching? it on? It was so you thought I was watching it. So this is like Instagram we're cutting this in. This is like a breakaway thing, guys. This it's is, not a loaf of bread. No, it's not a loaf. You're just stacking it in the pan however you can fit it in the pan and baking it. That's really yeah, I think the crux of it. Yeah, but if we would have formed it into a fucking loaf from jump, it would have fit as a you loaf. You can't form it into a loaf, babe. Why can't you? It was hollow. You, right? You push it together, and then you push it in the pan. Right. You think this is how people have made bread for hundreds of years? Did I say that? They damn sure didn't stuff it into a loaf pan like you're claiming. That's how... No, they molded it into a loaf, as I said. What would have been important putting garlic and everything out. else on there? Stuff it inside. Comes over the top. No, they cut it all up and they stacked it in. Yes, there. I didn't know it was like a grabber's thing. It was. I thought you were making a loaf of Why garlic bread. Just put there, it's like fine. two over here. That side's built up already. So show everybody before sides. it's cooked. Mm -hmm. Gotta be even. Don't mind us, guys. We're just assholes. Mm. Hey, this is us. This is what you signed up for. I got to the mic. Man, I'm yeah, I'm sweating. This is before. Hold on, let me trim this part. Papa Molly, I'm sweat. This is before, because I don't want nothing to drip over. I mean, it don't really matter. It's just like bread, but. Open that. One second, I'm trying to clear the dumb shit off your screen. Sorry if I'm shaking the camera on you guys. There's a lot on that screen. So as you see, it's kind of just stuffed in there. They're like I said, grabber pieces. Hopefully it'll bake up right for you. I don't understand how those Whoa. bottom pieces are going to crisp. It bakes at 450 for 10 minutes. You said 375. My bad, 450. 450, y'all. It's up. No, wait. No, wait, what? You want to set the timer? Where do I want? 10 to 12 minutes, it says. So I'll do 11. And then I'll check on it and make sure it's okay. All right, guys. So I'm going to pull the cam. I'm going to turn the camera I'm off for a second. I'm going to pull out, guys. I'm going to pull out. Salute Reyes. I never met someone that acts themselves when they come in chats. <laughs> Most of us say hi to other people, right? Yeah, Captain, love you so much. Reyes is like, what up, Reyes? Not much, Reyes. Thanks, Reyes. <laughs> You're the man, Reyes. I'm Reyes. Let me wash my hands. Here, let this out, uh, Tim. What? Let that. Uh, wanted to actually find my head without losing my mind here. You want it to fucking? Fucking. I don't know how we can do that on camera. We're making some uh, pull apart garlic bread. We're making garlic bread. Oh, shit. I didn't put the cheese on. That was gross. Well, it almost just played us, so it looked <laughs> like the fucking screeching. I forgot the cheese. You can wait a few minutes. Well, I don't want to put it on right away anyway because I don't want the cheese to, like... I want to be able to taste the cheese. I want to see the stringy part of the cheese when I pull it apart. Just give us one more sec, guys. We're cleaning this table off. We're laying out some gaggers and some Bolivian. Some pure Colombian. <laughs> right, you got flour all over your shirt. Mm. I got to switch back to my account because yours is too fucking... Stupid to navigate. Blarfinger. Blarfinger. 
All right, guys, we're going to play uh, while we have a minute here to clean up. We're going to play too many. Playing My Nerves. Playing My Nerves by Kells. Take it away. We'll play too many chances. Might as well call all the shit and sing. It's the same song. I'm going to do a camera check. I got to do a camera check. Too many chances by your mother's left underwear. By oh shit. Awesome. Jazz. He's done rocking out with his pocket. We got four minutes, y'all. 
Right. So we got some fresh Parmesan. And some white cheddar. Why wouldn't you get mozzarella? Because I didn't want it. You said get cheese. I got the one I wanted. Any other dumbass fucking comments? Go ahead. Sure. How do I get flour on me? I didn't even barely touch the shit. It travels. That's what you get. I don't think there's a whippy piece. That last song was Kill, Up, Kill Us All. If you're interested, that's one of mine too. Uh, How did we get? I gotta put cheese on it. There's only three minutes left. Well, wait for it to brown some and then you throw the cheese on it. Wow. Mama T said, Tune in next week to Cooking with Kells to see Mama T changed name. <laughs> <laughs> I like white cheddar. Thank you, Mon. Yes, hit that like button for us if you haven't, guys. Click the X in the live chat. Like. Live chat brings you right back. Takes one second. And then some rich asshole might see these assholes and say, I can make money off those assholes and give us an asshole deal. I better be able to sign a John J. asshole or I'm out of here. Well, two minute warning. Two minute warning. You know what they say. I don't. I'm just saying that. That's true, Mama T. She said, talk about talking about the flower. She said, it's like Kool-Aid. Even when you think it's all in the picture, you find it on the counter. That's true. Like, or your hands. Side of your hands all blue. You're like, what the fuck? Or red. Look like you blood to death. Making Kool -Aid. That's why you should do like me and only drink Kool-Aid lemonade. Doesn't leave any stain. I always add lemon juice to it. Just a capful. You said you let it brown. Right. Get your cheese on there. It looks like pita. Hmm. Pita bread. Let's watch this. That's where we're at so far, guys. We're just going to put some cheese on and get it back in there. We're using sharp cheddar apparently instead of uh, mozzarella. We always use mozzarella. Because it's the best. Broaden your fucking horizon, bud. Whew. I'm trying to get it in between pieces. I just want it melty. It's just like cascading all. It should be a nice melty moving on the right Catching all the pieces. Ooh, that'd be wet, so it'll stick. Ooh, put some palm on there. Cannot skimp on the Parmesan choice. <sighs> Yes, pretty much sure. Ain't it? That side's hot. Why are you touching it with your hand? Fucking hot. What do you mean? Yeah, I was waiting for the heat to get, get them gushing past me. I'm so gonna put a thing in. So we put the cheese on. on. We'll go. Do like three, three. Four. We'll go four more minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll give it a little more time to brown because they were already starting to firm. Bang, bang. Damn, that's on. Oh. Fucking zipper ain't working right. No, I was having a problem with it too. Yeah. Let's put it in a bag. M Mama T said, I don't like parm cheese. It smells like dirty feet. But it tastes so good. 
Monica, I am dying for some D'Alessandro's. My brother. We had cheesecakes tonight. Grilled cheese and used provolone instead of regular cheese. <coughs> and it smelled like somebody threw up all over the kitchen. Yes, it did. But he was in seventh heaven talking about it's so good though. I'm I gonna, don't like Swiss cheese because it smells like feet. I'm going to give you guys uh, a couple seconds as I do each episode. I'm going to hold the recipe up to the screen here for you. You can screenshot, come back later, whatever. We leave it off for about 20 seconds. So first I'll give you, this is your ingredients. That's my rough draft. Guys. Rough draft, if you can tell by the huge X. Mm -hmm. I was starting a different So one. here's your ingredients. I'll give you 10 seconds with that. And then the cooking directions. But we ran through those in the beginning. Oh, Once again, again for you. five cups of flour, two cups of warm water, one package of the yeast, olive oil is needed, pinch of salt. Uh, once the dough is made, we spread our mixture of butter, gar uh, minced garlic, um, and some parsley, others. parsley, oregano, and basil. Mm -hmm. Put that mixture on the inside, cut them down the slices, and stack them in the pan. Um, we went for 11 minutes, hold, uh, added cheese, another four minutes. So once again, I'll put the recipe up for a screenshot. There we go. And like usual, I will post. Everything will be online. It'll be in the description once I share it or once I end and I can get it back in there. But I did post the list of ingredients that you would need should you want to follow along. Salute to the chat, Rock and out with us. Excuse me, Come on. Your Instagram is weird, bro. Why? It's like telling you about shit. I don't know why you would even care. Most of the time, I don't. But it's like Marvel uploaded a story. Just story. It's like, yeah. Congrats to Marvel. Uh, I yeah. care why. Else, after the lives, Kells does go back and put the recipes in the description. Yeah, so I was just saying, I usually once once we end this or whatever, I usually go back in and I fix it. And then I put the recipe in there with the instructions. And then there's pictures on uh, Instagram. Make sure you guys are following Cooking with Kells on Instagram. You can find everything. We got about 30 seconds left, guys. I'm going to see what we're looking at. And cheese melted. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how brown the bread was before because it's covered in cheese. It was just starting to get toasty. Plus, I didn't fully grasp the concept, so I already smushed it all together. <laughs> it's just yeah, yeah but you got to so cut more. Meat. You got to cut more square to do it the way you were trying to do it. Too. Well, in the thing, they had rolled it out to a rectangle yeah. and then smeared it, and That's then saying, went up and down, cutting time, it and stacked it like that, and then jammed it in there. Loaf. Next time, I'm just going to grab globs of it and stuff it in there that way. Like you roll a ball, put it in there, put some cheese and everything on there, and then you put another ball. You know what I mean? Because you All can right. do it in we a We got some browning on the top. Oven is off. We're just going to keep it in there. We're going to go another minute, roast it two minutes. Can. Just roast Usually, it you could take a flower pot, one of the um, clay or whatever it is, flower pot. And you get the, the dough and you roll it into the ball, right? And then they would just drop it in, like drop like three of the balls in there, right? In your case, you would obviously put that stuff on there, you know, before you drop the balls in there. Then you would put like a layer of cheese and whatever else in there, then a couple more of the dough balls, then more cheese, and you stack it up like that, and then you just put the whole freaking flour pot in the oven and cook it that way, and it just pulls apart when, you, when you're John cooking. Madden, Betty White, Bob Saget, all back to back. America's coach, America's grandma, and America's dad. Mm -hmm. This is for Jen <laughs> and for Kels, because I love her. And she wasn't even here last week, so she missed Yeah, Jen missed a kiss last week. I go out my way for somebody that ain't even here. Ignore him. I had to go out my way to kiss you. <laughs> it is a curse. Best thing that ever happened to you. Anyway. 
<laughs> you what I do. Oh, man, uh, Make faces at the fucker. Damn, <laughs> we should be working at Panera, bruh. These hands. Fucking cheesy hotness. Hot dick it jam. Oh, yeah. Leave it, let it sit for a sec. Yeah, I ain't fucking with this right now. I'm not crazy. Well, I am crazy, but a clear plate. I'm trying to get some cheesy gooey gooeyness here for them. Get it the tongue or something so you can. It's just going to rip apart in pieces now. But that's all you're aiming for, guys. You just. You know, flip it onto a plate after it cools for a few minutes, but that's kind of the idea here. You just grab and go type thing. Mm hmm. That's exactly the idea. So here's what we pulled off. We're going to let that cool for a sec. The rest of this I'm going to pull off. Put in there so yeah, it can roast and cook a little more still, right. just in case. You want to make sure the bottom's cooked so you so can yeah. put it back in. So, guys, do remember that as brown as you see it here, we did take it out just a little early. And that's also why. I wanted to stack it the way we did, so I knew that the bottom was getting what it needed to get, so everything cooks at once. Just make sure your dough is done. But remember, we didn't use egg, and it did bake already. So even though we use flour, it won't it won't hurt you if you do eat some some dough. Can I get in here, Richard? I thought you wanted to go on your side. You're on that side. Yes, I know. Still, I fucking still hot. Take a little bite of this one. Well, this is the end. I ain't getting no garlic. Look this bad boy. That must be big. It's because of the way it rolled mm. out. That's see. That's the benefit of using the minced garlic. If we would have used garlic powder, you wouldn't fucking taste it. The mm -hmm. minced garlic really, it really makes the difference. Or whole garlic, whatever you guys like. The recipe originally called for the whole clove, but onion, I use yeah. mint. Onion powder, just don't cut it. Now, mind you guys, we all have a quick, we'll give you the quick, you know, I'm throwing spaghetti together for my kids. How can I make a quick garlic bread? Butter, garlic, and Parmesan. That's all you need on a roll. Bread, white bread, we've done everything over the years. I have. I've Rye made bread. tons of different kinds of garlic bread. So here we have a piece. I think most recently I took Amoroso roll. Here we have a piece with some cheese, some garlic. Like you guys see the good brown on there? Mm. That's good. Mm. There you go, guys. Pull, pull away uh, garlic bread. Mm -hmm. You're covered. That's what I'm saying. You're like you're fucking dancing and shit. You guys have any idea? Excuse me. If you have any ideas for anything you guys want to see on here, you can leave it anywhere. Live chats, comment sections afterwards. My channel, which is the Dirty Kenzo, if you don't know, um, Dirty Kenzo Productions. Um, like I said, my page, IG, either of our IGs. Anything you guys want to see tonight? Thank you, Kitty, for the chicken and dumpling suggestion. We're definitely going. Uh, that's definitely going in the uh, you know future episode book. Mm -hmm. um, I just want to say thank you guys. I see the love you guys show Kel as myself as well, and I appreciate how you love us both. So. We both do. Um, you I thank you. I'm going to leave you to Kel for a second and get us set up over here. Appreciate y'all. Like I said, well, like he said, make sure Kathy, welcome. Kenny, specific. salute, bro. Leave it down below or a comment. I usually yeah, just pretty fast. Remember, it's easier for us to see things after the live. Like mm -hmm. if you were writing it right now, we could possibly miss it. Kels, Kels is watching this live the second we're done. She goes back and reviews everything. That's how I kind of learned where to hold the speaker and how we move and operate certain it's ways. It's easier to go back and see what we're doing to fix anything we want to fix and stuff like that. Plus, I get to see what you guys are saying like at the time that I'm actually talking to you, and I can't see you right now. So it's a little easier. Sometimes. Appreciate that, Al. Al said, hit that like for that garlic bread with fire. <laughs> Thanks, because it's bomb. Hey, everybody showed a lot of love tonight, man. We really appreciate you guys. Anything else you want to say? Yeah.
Thank you guys for joining us. Make sure you come back for chicken and dumplings next Thursday. And we try to give warning if we're not coming on. Um, I usually try to, and I'm sorry for the last couple times I didn't holidays. tell you guys. Yeah, it was holidays. Like it's all. weird. But I think we're available next Thursday already. It looks open, so we should be good. Yeah, sure. we should be okay. Holidays are over, so. Yeah, usually we're good unless something with work comes up when it comes to me anyway. But but we appreciate you guys. You are the best. Uh, we'll play international on the way out, chatting with you guys as always. And uh, Kel's Cupcakes. Give them, blow them a kiss. A blow them a kiss. My cuppy cakes. Here you go. One, one, one from, from us to you. <laughs> Just what you guys always wanted. Salute, guys. We'll see you next Thursday. International. Mm. Come follow me. Come follow me. Come, pull a me, 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 come, pull a me,